Pakistan's former Prime Minister Imran Khan has been sentenced to 10 years in prison in a case where he was accused of leaking state secrets. Uh, it's the cricketer-turned-politician's second conviction in months and also the harshest. The ruling comes just 10 days before the country heads to the polls. It's alleged that Khan's shared the contents of a secret cable that was sent by Pakistan's ambassador in Washington to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in Islamabad. He has denied the charges and said that the contents appeared in the media from other sources. Now, his party has vowed to challenge the conviction. Khan is already serving a three-year jail term on corruption charges, and he claims all legal cases that have been brought against him are politically motivated. The vice chairman of Khan's PTI party and former foreign minister, Shah Mahmood Qureshi, has also been sentenced to 10 years in the same state secrets case. For more, Hira Mustafa joins us. She's live from Islamabad. Hira, how has the public actually reacted to Mr Khan's sentencing? Well, the legal team of Khan has requested and appealed the protesters and supporters of the party not to exercise calm and restraint and not to come out on the streets in order to protest today's verdict as they have filed a petition before Islamabad High Court. And they're hopeful that in the coming days, the party might expect a relief from Islamabad High Court. The former Prime Minister Imran Khan and former Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi were tried in a court and in that context uh, the judge appointed a, a pers his personal defense counsel to represent Imran Khan and uh, uh, former foreign minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi uh, in that context uh, Imran Khan voiced disappointment saying that uh, uh, this uh, trial is no less than a joke as uh, uh, both the prosecutor team and defense team uh, belongs to the government. Earlier, Islamabad High Court uh, uh, ruled that uh, this needs to be an open trial and both the Khan's legal team and media must be given access to. However, uh, this ruling was denied. Hira, Mr. Khan remains a highly popular politician in Pakistan. What impact will this sentencing have on the upcoming elections? Well, this decision comes at the time when uh, Pakistan is just a week away from the elections. Uh, the party leaders uh, of Khan has urged all the party supporters uh, uh, to come out in large numbers in upcoming polls to cast their vote and to show loyalty to Imran Khan, who is one of the populist uh, leaders in Pakistan. And Imran Khan is also barred from uh, taking part in the upcoming polls as he is facing corruption charges, uh, which he denies. Uh, the three times former Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif, who returns to the country last year after self imposed exile, is considered to be the front runner. Uh, his party welcomes uh, Tuesday's decision, uh, saying nobody has the right to play with national security of country. Hira, thank you for that. Hira Mustafa, there, live for us in Islamabad.